What's up everybody? So for this video, I'm going to show you how to hold a calligraphy pen, or more or less how I hold my Pilot Parallel Pens. So let's go ahead and get started. So for one, holding a calligraphy pen, the way I look at it is basically the same way as holding a regular pencil or even holding a pen. The main thing you want to remember is to not grip your pen super tight. There's no need to hold it super tight because if you do, this is what happened to me recently and it was so, so bad for me and I didn't realize what the hell was going on. And you wanna basically, it's all in the wrist and not gripping it tight. You always want to be reaching. And another thing is you do not want to rush through the work or through whatever you're working on. So same thing with the pencil. There's no need to rush. It's good. The paper is not going to get up and walk away. So now let me actually pick up the pens, take the caps off and show you the best way to go about using them or not using them holding them okay this one is the six millimeter pilot parallel pen and parallel pens used for broad edge calligraphy if you did not know and see how i have it pointed at an angle just resting this is a comfortable way for me for you it may be different and just want to take your time holding very loosely and not tight because if you hold it too tight how I had mentioned earlier you're going to strain this muscle in here and once you do that trust me you're gonna realize I was holding it way too tight and now let's switch to the 3.8 millimeter. What I've learned from using the six to the 3.8, the 3.8 to me shows a lot more, how do you say, imperfections. And you really have to be confident using this one compared to the six millimeter, which I feel is, if you are have like a steady hand, you can go through the letters without hesitation. Let's, let me show you real quick. If you can go through. Because you see, that's how, this is how it looks with the six millimeter nib. And then now, 3.8. See, totally different, of course, in the nib size, but you just gotta, you know, just feel the pen and not hold it super tight. You want to be relaxed and not rushing. So I'm gonna do an S. And another thing is you want to reach. Holding your pen like this is gonna strain. You wanna extend your pointer finger this is what works for me. I'm not saying it's right or wrong. And just be nice and relaxed. See, nice and relaxed, nice and calm. We do a different S. Okay, so let's do a quick recap. Two pens that I use in this video, six millimeter and 3.8 Pilot Parallel Pens, both are for broad edged calligraphy. And when you're holding the pen, you want to hold it with your pointer finger extended and not gripping the pen very, very hard. Because if you grip it too hard, you're going to end up straining 
the muscle here and once you do that you're gonna realize there's no need for me to rush and no need for me to be holding the pen super tight so I hope this helped you and before we go out I'm gonna have it at a 90 degree angle cuz look well I guess would that be 90 or 45 yeah, I guess it'd be a 45. Because there we go, 45 degree angle. See, I figured it out. So this would be your hand and then your wrist. Just a little quick mock up. And the pin. So, 45 degree angle, and do not rush. Thanks for watching the video. Leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, it is free. And new video every Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thanks for watching.